Some people think that baptism is not required to be saved. But let me tell you, I believe it is entirely the opposite. In John 3, 5, this is written, Jesus answered, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, except a man be born of water and of the Spirit, he cannot enter into the kingdom of God. So in this verse, Jesus Christ himself said that baptism is needed to get to heaven. Another example is in Acts 2.38, when Peter is speaking unto some people wondering about baptism, Peter replies with this, Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sins, and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. One other example is written in the Gospel of Mark in chapter 16, verse 16, saying this, He that believeth and is baptized shall be saved, but he that believeth not shall be damned. So what we can get from this verse is, it says that we both need to be baptized and be believing to be saved. Adding on, one may argue about the thief on the cross, and I'll be honest, I don't know enough about paradise in the Bible and what Jesus meant when he was speaking to the thief, so I can't argue too much against it. But what I can say is Jesus said to do something, and his disciples spoke to do the same thing, so I believe it is right to obey. And Jesus was also baptized, so why shouldn't we? Adding on to that, baptism alone isn't what saves us, but I believe it is something we must do among other things like living by the Spirit, mortifying the flesh, repenting for sins, and other things to get to heaven. Now, I hope you enjoyed this little message. Have a good one.